Hey there guys, Luke here with the Outdoor Gear Review. I hope you're all doing well. Today for this episode, this is a snapshot preview for the month of March 2015. In this episode, we will be going over basically what you can expect to see from the Outdoor Gear Review in the month of March. We have a lot of projects, we have a lot of things going on, we have lots of gear and testing. You guys are going to see a lot this month. It's going to be a very good one. Now, of course, there will likely be some surprises. I have lots of ideas, things come together, things fall apart. That's how it goes. So this is just a brief guide to what you should expect. Of course, nothing is guaranteed. That's life, right? So with that being said, why don't we go ahead and get started. Now, I'm sure everybody wants to know about when is our next overnight adventure coming up, and that is coming up just as soon as the weather clears. It has been nothing but snow and lots of it, ice and lots of it, and rain and lots of it. Now, I love wintertime, you guys know that, but we are now going into springtime, and that means that the rain is going to start soon. We get an average of six feet of rain a year here, so it is a constant battle against nature to get outdoors and to be able to record videos in that sense. But yes, our first video, our first overnight adventure will be to Lone Wolf Mountain. It will be the first time that I show off the mountain, show off the new property to you all, and I'm super duper excited to do that. Now, in addition to the overnight adventure, we will have a number of videos related to projects, to things that I'm working on with the new property, and that will include building with rocks, making some fire pits, uh, sawing up some trees, and stuff like that. So we definitely have a lot going on. In the future, I will be tapping a spring, which will be a big project where I actually will build a spring box. So that will take a lot of work, and that won't be for a little while still. But definitely lots of videos in regards to the new property. Come on, weather! Woo! I want to get outdoors. <laughs> <laughs> now, for this month, we have a number of restoration projects taking place. One includes some axe restorations. As you can see here, this thing has seen better days for sure. I found this at a friend's house, stuck in the dirt, and man, I just wanted it. I want to take this thing and I want to bring it back to life. So that is one project that we will be working on. Also, I will be working to restore a number of small axes and hatchets, so definitely something to look forward to. Another restoration project deals with kerosene lanterns. I'm a big fan of kerosene lanterns, oil lanterns, and stuff like that. So I have a number of lanterns that I've had for a long time that I want to restore, get back into operating order, so we have that coming up too. Now we do have a number of knife projects coming up, including a customization knife project. We're going to take either a uh, Becker BK-16 or a K-Bar Mark I, and we're going to customize it, we're going to strip the paint off, and just do some work on it, make it our own. In addition to that, we will be giving the final product away to one of our viewers, because you guys are worth it and I appreciate you. In addition to those videos, we will also have an outdoor fitness video. That's right, a brand new one for the year, and that will be a total body workout. I receive a lot of questions a lot of requests to continue that series, so absolutely, your wish is granted. Also on the channel, we will have a number of how-to videos, including how to wash the 20-liter jerry can that I just recently showed off. I received a number of requests on how to do that, how I would go about it, so that is coming your way as well. Now, when it comes to gear, let me tell you folks, we have a lot of gear coming up that we'll be previewing and reviewing. We have the Sunjack Waterproof Light Stick. This thing is very, very cool. I've been using this for the last couple of weeks and it is awesome. I cannot wait to show this thing off to you. It is a cool product. We have two products from Snug Pack, including the Endurance Pack, which a number of you have requested. Got that for you. And we also have the Stratosphere Bivy from Snug Pack. Again, another item that has been greatly requested on this channel, so I have made sure to make that happen for you all. We have a hammock from Yukon Outfitters, and that is the Freedom Hammock. Preview coming soon. We have a 1500 milliamp battery pack solution from RAV Power coming up. We have the Vanquist IBEX30 backpack coming up in preview form. Also, my friends, we have the EcoVita microfiber travel towel along with the Task 1 multi-tool iPhone case. 
And right there, that is just the beginning. We have a number of additional backpacks and gear coming out. We have a very inexpensive stove preview coming up. We have backpacks from Mammut, from Black Diamond, from Gregory, and so on. Also, for all of you flashlight lovers, we have a video showing off the differences between a neutral white flashlight and a cool white flashlight. I have received a lot of requests in regards to this, so consider it done. That is coming up. There will be clothing as well such as items from Carhartt. I receive a lot of comments and questions about Carhartt, so we're going to be showing off some gloves, we're going to be showing off some rain gear, and some pants coming up soon. Now for our snapshot preview for the month of March 2015, that's pretty much it. And as you can see there, we have a lot in the works, a lot in the pipeline. And right now we put out three to four videos a week, and we may actually bump that up. We have a lot of gear, we have a lot of tutorials and how-to, a lot of educating to do, so we may be bumping up the video count. We shall see how that works out. Now, one thing that should be mentioned is that I receive a lot of questions about how you guys can support the channel. I am currently working on something that will allow you all to support the channel very, very easily. It's easy to opt into, it's also easy to opt out of. So that is coming up soon. So again, I do want to thank you all very, very much for your support of the Outdoor Gear Review over the last two years. Our reviews are 100% honest. They're non-biased. And we receive zero compensation for the videos or if you go out and purchase something that you see in one of our videos. I don't have a store. I'm not trying to sell anything. That is not my prerogative. And the Outdoor Gear Review will never be like that. I never want to have a store where I offer products because you start taking away from the integrity of the review when you're trying to push something, when you're trying to make a profit, when there's money involved. And we're not going to go that route. So the Outdoor Gear Review is fully funded by myself. And if you guys want to chip in and help support us, we appreciate it, no doubt. So my friends, for the March 2015 preview, that's pretty much it. If you guys have any questions for me, Please feel free, drop me a line, let me know, make sure to like, comment, share, subscribe, all that good stuff, and I'll see you guys around. Strength and honor, be well, be good to each other.